Awesome. Well, good evening, everyone, and welcome to our Tuesday night shred webinar. So glad that you could all be here. My name is Dana Toddy. I'm a partner with the Juice Plus company, and I've been taking the product myself for seven months. I've had some pretty good results and um, love their bars, love their shakes, love everything about Juice Plus. Um, I recently had a, got to share a little testimonial, so I want to share that with you tonight, that a month into taking my Juice Plus, I could see a shift in my hormones. And in January, I had my blood taken and it proved what I was feeling. I have a benign tumor on my pituitary gland. And thanks to Juice Plus, my numbers are in the normal range. I've never had that in 21 years. So very exciting. So I wanted to share that. Thank you for being here. And now I'd like to take this opportunity to introduce Kristen. Kristen has been in the health industry for 27 years, a nutritionist for 15 of those years. She's a mom of three, lives in Milton, has an amazing husband, and uh, has been taking the Juice Plus products for 13 years. So you're in good hands tonight if you haven't already met her, and I'll now hand it over to her. Thank you so awesome. much, Kristen. Awesome, awesome. Thanks, Dana. All right, let me share my screen. And let me go all the way up here. I was going over my slides here, so. Okay, let me now find, there we go. Okay, now let me move all you guys over here, up here, so I can just see my screen. Amazing. So Dana is going to be, um, just looking in the chat. So if you have questions, don't feel like you have to wait, just type them in the chat and um, she will answer them as we go. And then of course, at the end, I'll open it up and you guys can ask whatever it is you want. So thank you, ladies. I don't think we have any men here. So thank you, ladies, for coming. And uh, this is um, actually, you know what? We've actually not done a shred webinar. I've done them before, but we haven't actually done it in this capacity before and we've done shreds. And so this is exciting because we are launching a February shed and it's all a shred and it's all about self love. Okay, so this is the month of love. So why not love on ourselves more? Because ladies, you know that if you don't take care of yourself, it's hard to give from an empty cup. All right, so we're going to talk about what Shred is and why you want to take part in it. So we are uh, having facing two huge problems in our world. Number one, we have seen the environmental toxin load increase dramatically since our grandparents' day. Okay, so our bodies are bombarded with toxins. You will hear me talk about this all the time on social media, in our webinars, it's a problem. And if you wanted to do more research, if you're one of those kind of people, I suggest go for it because um, the awesome thing about it is it can seem very, um, you know, uh, in, intimidating if I wanna say, but your body was designed to detoxify. We were given detoxification pathways, detoxification organs for your body to rid these toxins. The problem is, because we're taking in more toxins from what we put on our skin, what we wash our hair with, we wear a laundry soap all day long, and the base ingredient of our laundry soap is a carcinogen. We um, drink water that has toxins, right? Either through our skin or what we're putting in our mouth from the food, from our emotions, toxins are coming from everywhere. The problem is our bodies are so bombarded, our liver is bombarded, that it's having a hard time eliminating on a daily basis. So that's why we need to help our body out. And I promise you, if you're experiencing, you know, unwanted weight pounds, you know, if you're experiencing, you know, anxiousness or depressive type feelings, mood type instability, if you're experiencing, you know, bloating, um, your hair is thin or falling out, your hormones are out of whack and the list can go on. That is a good reason why you want to take part in a, a shred program, which is actually a lifestyle um, of detox and cleansing. So our second problem, 
those of you that have been to these uh, webinars before, this is a different one, but you've heard me say this, our food quality is decreasing. So we live a life that is very busy. I mean, how many here on the call could raise your hand and say, yes, I'm very busy and I don't have time to cook healthy meals and I don't have, you know, and I don't have time for prep. We've all said it. And every single, single one of us here on this Zoom tonight feels the exact same way. I feel this way and I'm a nutritionist, right? Like I feel the same way. I'm like, this is why I love my tower garden because literally every day, which I crave now, I pick off of my garden and I make a huge salad. So this is the thing is there's ways that we can make it easy or there is ways we just have to have that desire. But look here on the screen, we are living in a world where there's fast food, fried food, frozen food, canned food, jarred food, and you name it. Look at the grocery aisle. Most of our grocery store are like, are, is like this. Okay. So we know that we're not getting the seven to 13 recommended servings of fruits and vegetables. And if you're eating that much, that is amazing. Keep going, but we still need to feed the gaps and we'll talk about why. Okay. So this is normal, but there is a solution um, for us to be get better quality. So this is, I love this slide. This slide is actually being something I've used for actually a number of years now, probably 12, 13 years. So we have a society where diets and restrictive, restrictive programs are the rage. The diet industry is billions, it makes billions and billions and billions. Probably the pharmaceutical world and the dieting world are like two of the top making industries that it will never end, okay? So that's normal. Many of you probably have said, yep, yeah, I've tried a few diets, right? I talk to women all the time that tell me I have done every diet under the sun. So, and you know what? What I say to you, if that's you, is I say good for you for not giving up. Honestly, it's all about your perspective, right? But here, and I don't wanna say but, I don't like the word but. However, you didn't give up. However, the thing is, is that when we're focusing on programs that are restrictive and programs that are not focusing on lifestyle, that's key, or not focusing on, you know, putting in micronutrition and focusing on fueling our cells to balance our body, it's never going to work. It will never, ever, ever, ever work. Is it going to be, um, take a little bit longer? Maybe it will right? Probably, but it's never going to work. So we look at this here. We look at the grace uh, top part. We have somebody who's overweight. And what a lot of people don't realize is when we go on diets, our body is actually eating our lean muscle tissue. It's actually eating away at our body, <laughs> not what we want it to eat away, right? We don't want it. We, it's eating away at muscle and tissue. It's not eating away at what we want to eat away. Okay. So what happens is we see the rebound, right? So we have this person who wants to release weight and is going on this program full of toxins. They're not, they don't know that they just want to get rid of the weight. So what happens is, is that they think if they die in an exercise, I've come from the fitness world 27 years ago, when I started in this health industry, it was in the fitness world. And I was like, I need to get out of here fast because, and still to this day, so many people, I just, well, I haven't worked there for two years now, but Good Life Fitness, I worked there for many years. Um, just kind of like a, my hobby I get paid for teaching classes. And I will tell you that still people, especially women today are just eat well, just eat well. And um, we're not talking micronutrition well, but just eat well and exercise. But the problem is that doesn't, it's not all that we need. It's about lifestyle. It's about looking at the holistic person. Okay. So if this is what we're doing. We're dieting, we're exercising, we're doing our best to eat well. Um, but what, ha and then we have all the stressors. Okay. Yes, we shrink, you know, you shrink because you've experienced that, but the problem is we rebound back because we're not focusing on the right areas. So cleansing a lifestyle of cleansing and detoxification on a daily basis is a shift in our perspective. Okay. And I really encourage you to really, you might have to hear this a few times to really for that light bulb to go off, but that's okay. Okay. So the shift is to understand that, that we're taking in all these toxins. Now, what happens is toxins are chemicals. We'll say, we'll say chemicals that they store in fat. Okay. In your fat cells, they store. 
the reason they store in fat cells and they'll find more and the body will make more fat to store in your, in, to make sure the chemicals are stored there. Cause your body knows if it has too many toxins and it doesn't have enough fat, guess where the toxins go? They go to your organs. They go to your oh. brain. That's oh. the problem, right? So we need to make sure that we're eliminating toxins. So we have to think, I think this on a daily basis. Well, I don't think this every day because I just know this now I live it. But I think about, you know, how much water I'm drinking. It's eliminating toxins, right? Um, what kind of food I'm eating through the day because it's helping support my body to eliminate toxins. How many bowel movements do I have in a day, right? One is not enough. We need to be having at least two bowel movements a day. Constipation is actually less than three bowel movements a day. Your doctor is not going to tell you that because that's, remember, that's not their area of expertise, okay? Their area of expertise is on, um, focused on um, basically medicine, right? That's what their training is, okay? So we have to recognize that the toxins are storing. So we shed the toxins. Guess what happens, ladies? We shed the toxins, what we're going to be talking about tonight, how to do that. And then the fat cells start to go, melt away, right? Because they're not needed to store the toxins. And your body's very happy because your body's job is to make sure you don't die. And then you are like this right guy here and you, ha you have more muscle. The muscle didn't waste away. You have less fat. You have more energy and you don't rebound. That's what you want. That's what makes you age well. That's what it makes you age backwards, right? That's what makes you have a stronger metabolism in your 50s and 60s. And so how do we do this? How can we get more food in our, in our every day that's more micronutrition, more nutrient dense? And that's, I, we have to throw this tower um, image in. If you haven't been to our tower webinar, you absolutely need to come. We are having one next Wednesday night. Most of our webinars are on Wednesdays, but it is Tuesday tonight. Um, gets confusing. So um, is it Tuesday tonight? It is Tuesday tonight. Oh my gosh, it feels like Wednesday tonight right now. Anyways, it's been a long week already. No, it's Wednesday today. Yeah, it's Wednesday today. Okay, whoo, good, it's Thursday tomorrow. Okay, so you don't have to have a green thumb. You can grow your own produce. Produce. It's affordable and it yields tons. And the taste of it is absolutely amazing. It really is. I'm not saying that to sell you. I'm telling you, I promise you, my 12 year old does not like salads and I don't blame her because the stuff you buy in the store is just not good. And she will eat the salad. So that's a testament. Okay. And she's being raised in a house like this. She's like, oh, it's kids can be so much fun. So the shred program is about you fueling your body, your cells with 45 whole plant foods. When in our day, do we get this much produce? We don't, we don't, right? So how many of us have had parsley today? And did we, and you might say I did have parsley, but did you have bushels of parsley? Did you have parsley that was vine ripened, chemical free, and was not heated or destroyed, and you knew was NSF certified? Okay, that's a big deal. And it was like bushels of it. We, none of us can say that, right? So we're not saying that this, people say, well, if I take this, does that mean I don't have to eat all of the other vegetables? I'm like, no, you can start with this, but let's start adding in if that's where you're at. It's not to replace whole, like good, healthy eating. Okay. So look at this. This is quite beautiful. Um, the shakes alone have 15. The shakes are plant powered, different from other companies that have plant shakes, because these ones, we know there is no toxicity. We know there's no metals. We know there's no arsenic. And we, there's sprouts and all the good stuff in them. We'll go over that. But um, it's really important to understand that the studies that have been done on it and what it shows in our body, which I'll go over that. Um, okay, so here we go. Low glycemic, our blood sugar needs to be balanced all the time. Okay, so when we eat, our blood sugar goes up and then our insulin level or your insulin level, your insulin is an anabolic hormone, which means it's a fat storing hormone. Okay, when you're stressed, Guess what happens to your insulin? It goes up. When you're, and that's when you're not sleeping well and you're tired, you're stressed. Guess what happens? Your insulin level goes up. If you're mentally, we're like worried and stressed and anxious. 
Guess what happens to our stress levels? Goes up. Guess what happens to our insulin? The fat storing hormone, it goes up. This is why when we balance our hormones as a lifestyle, this is when we can become the ideal weight our body wants to be, not what you think you should be, what our body is happy at, okay? So these shakes have been clinically proven to balance blood sugar levels. When your blood sugar levels are balanced, it means that your other hormones, the sex hormones, the mood hormones, the stress hormones, the sleeping hormones, you know, the hormones that we need to make sure we get a good sleep, they all are balanced. When, when insulin goes up, they start to come down and inflammation, the root of all disease goes up. Okay. So these are proven scientifically that third party, that these will help balance your blood sugar. And that means you're not going to crave. That means you're not going to be hungry all the time. If you're hungry, ladies listening, if you're hungry every two to three hours, we need to change that. Okay, if you have to eat every two to three hours, that's something we learned many years ago, even in nutrition school, that is not something that I teach anymore. So as a metabolic balance coach, I teach, which is all about balancing hormones, reducing inflammation. I teach that we want to actually eat minimum four hours apart. It should be minimum. It should not be less than four hours because we need to make sure from breakfast to lunch that we are able to get that insulin back to healthy levels. If you keep eating, and you know, your insulin goes up, then it comes down. Then you eat again for a snack, then it comes down. Then you eat lunch, then it comes down. Then you eat a snack and then it comes down. Oh my goodness, your body's like, I, I can't even keep up. What that's, what's gonna happen is you're gonna hold on to more weight as well. And, and so we have the toxin issue, but then we have this hormone issue as well. Okay, so it's plant-based. There's probiotics in there um, to, for healthy gut. I've had a lot of people, their gut stuff going on has repaired, right? Because when your body is getting really healthy um, nutrition from your food. And then you're like, well, I eat a really healthy diet. I eat really, really, really well in the day. I'm like, great, stay there. But now when you add this micronutrition in, guess what happens now? Your body can actually use that food as medicine, as the very first physician said, 400 BC, Hippocrates said, let food be thy medicine, medicine be thy food. This is before the Western medicine became anything. He said, food should be our medicine. But and now we have, of course, like I said, toxins and all that thing that, and soil depletion that changes our, today is different, right, than, than 400 BC. Um, however, we do have a solution. So when you put this micronutrition in, guess what happens? Your body starts to use that micronutrition to repair and allow your body to heal what is going on that you are not even aware of. It's so powerful. It's so powerful. I don't even think people really, really um, get it. Okay. So when you're getting really good diet from your tower garden and from the good breakfast and the programs that we offer, like the shred program the, and the recipes and all the things we often offer in our community, meal plans, programs, oh my gosh, you are equipped then this is going to help you do deeper things in your body that you're not aware of. Now let's talk about omegas. So omegas um, are so important for reducing inflammation in your body. Okay, so if you are human, which you are here, um, and even animals too need this, you need omegas. We get a lot of omega-6 in our, in our diet. We are not getting enough omega-3s. Okay, if you have heart conditions, anything related to cardiovascular, you need even double. So I have people on, it's two a day as maintenance. I have people on four a day, okay? It's not gonna hurt you. Um, you can't really overdose. This isn't stored as fat. This is used by your brain. It's used for um, fuel. It's used in your body to, well, there, heart, brain, joints, skin, and eyes, okay? So if you have any issues in those areas, um, it's important that you have the right omega. And Alyssa, for those of you that are in our community and you know Alyssa, um, those of you that don't, you'll meet her at some point. So she's one of my friends and colleagues, and she's been in the nutrition industry for a very long time. This girl knows her stuff, and it's like she knows everything. I'm like, oh, I can't answer that question. Let me just ask Alyssa. <laughs> she usually can. Um, and she's really exciting to listen to as well. So um, she actually teaches the cancer program at the nutrition college that she teaches at. And um, she also is in practice, or um, well, she's in practice with cancer patients. So that's the area of her focus. 
And one of the things that she learned, and she, nobody would ever know this unless it, she was working with these patients that have had blood work done. And what they found, she would put them on a very good, high quality, good quality and good money um, that they were spending on a fish oil that was what they needed because of what they were going through with their treatments. What they found through studies is after she would put them on this product that was deemed to be very good, their, their levels, all their blood marker, uh, their markers in their test all went down, or sorry, all went up, sorry, it went up, it was not good. They, she took them off and she said, you know what, let's put this to the test. And she put them, she puts all of them on and, the, and their blood work, the inflammatory levels, um, CR, uh, CRP, which is um, um, inflammatory markers in the blood, guess what happened? Everything went down. So we've now seen that in blood work, not to mention that Juice Plus does third-party testing. It's NSF certified. So we have the research to back it up. But basically fish are toxic. We're toxic, talking about toxins. We're talking about not putting more toxins in. Fish are the most toxic creatures on the planet. So why don't we, why don't we just move the fish out? Because they don't get the omegas anyways. They're eating it from algae. We take the algae, they, um, and they put it with, see the oils here on the screen because they're very high in antioxidants. They're gonna make sure the oil is, does not go rancid. There's a nitrogen bubble in the, the capsule to make sure that by the time it gets to you, the oils are still quality. Because most people, when you're buying oil at the store right now, when, but when you're putting it in, it's already rancid. And guess what that rancid bad oil is doing? It's creating more inflammation. So this is, um, it, this is amazing. I started taking this. When I started taking this, my hair started growing thicker. And have you ever had that when now you have pieces coming out? Like I have to water it down. Like it just keeps coming. So, um, and I have very fine hair. So this is a good thing for me. So it's awesome. Um, Complete by Juice Plus, we said this. So when would you take this for in, in uh, Shred Program? You can, I have it for breakfast five days a week. Um, so for the 10 days, it's a 10 day program, which I'll go over. You would do it for 10 days in the morning. You can do two if you want. I've had it for a pre-workout. I've had it for a post-workout. I've had it for an afternoon snack. I even just had one for, um, for dinner. Okay. So basically what is shred? It's shredding the food toxins and the habits that are not serving you. That's it. So what you do today the choices that you make today are creating your tomorrow. And I want you to ask yourself this question. Where do I, how do I want to feel in one month from today? How do I want to feel? Like honestly ask yourself that question, right? We have to ask ourselves these questions to know what we need to do to change, to add in, right? So what do you want to feel in one month? What do you want to feel in quarter two? right? In six months in a year, where do you want to be in a year, right? We, we tend to just keep doing the same thing, expecting a different result and be like, this doesn't work. But the thing is, is that anything worthwhile is going to take some more effort. It's not going to, it's not necessarily going to come easy, especially if you have a mindset around health that nothing works for me, right? Are you telling yourself that nothing works for you? I've been on, so, this is what I hear all the time. I've been on so many diets I don't even know if I want to, like, in, I, well, they don't say invest, but I don't even know if I want to even try this, right? So that's a mindset. That's a belief that no matter what you do, nothing's going to change, right? My family has always been, I'm using weight as an example because we hear that so often. I, I, my family has never been healthy. And I just, maybe that's just the cards that I'm dealt with, but it's not. That's just a mindset. That's the story you're telling yourself. And we've got to change that story to, this is why in our community, those stories cannot exist here. And they start to, of course, but they cannot last. They cannot last because we, it's all about rising up and just being where you're at, acknowledging where you are, and just linking arms with the people that shared this with you and, and just taking one foot and putting it in front of the other. Okay, it it's, doesn't mean it's easy. It's easy to do and it's easy not to do. So here are our guidelines. Now, some of you might look at this and go, wow, that's really nothing. Like I kind of don't, I kind of do all of that. And then some of you are like, oh shoot, I gotta like, 
oh yeah, I'm eating the sugar and the caffeine and the alcohol. I got to give the alcohol up and all of these things, right? So everyone here is at a different place and that's okay. You might be here looking at this and I'm saying to you, you know what? Pick one thing that you do for 10 days. You don't have to do all of this. Maybe you just, you are not using Juice Plus yet. And maybe you just focus on adding that in and maybe drinking more water. And you do that for 10 days. This is not something we do one time. We do this on a regular basis. This is something that what you're doing in 10 days is now becoming a habit because your habits are what determine what's going to change for you, right? Um, our habits are automatic. So when you woke up this morning, what's the first thing you did? Probably the same thing as you did yesterday and the day before and the day before. Do you have a habit of exercising every day, right? Or do you have a habit of saying, I'll do it later? This week, that's what I've been doing. <laughs> okay, I'll just do it later. I know that if I do not work out in the morning, it, it's not going to happen. It's not, right? So scheduling is going to help. Um, you know, doing one to two shakes daily. I'm telling you, when you use those shakes, things change in your body. Is it because they're miraculous? No, it's just simple nutrition. And it's just, um, they taste so darn good too. And it's, it's just, it's all about the habits. So what are some of the symptoms or common, or not symptoms, but common results you might experience? This is a lot of the things we hear people say all the time, all the time, all the time. One of the cool things is about using Juice Plus, and kids can even use this, uh, kids can even do this, is that um, kids actually, kids are free, by the way, which is really cool for those of you that don't know, if a parent or an aunt or a grandmother is signed up, or a grandfather or whatever, um, but most people lose their cravings because a lot of the reasons for craving, cravings, there's a number of them, but uh, many times the reason is because you're not getting the micronutrition that, you're need, that your body needs, and it's just craving, it's craving sugar, usually that's what we're craving. Or if you're more stressed, you're going to be craving as well. But let's just talk about the micronutrition. When you're getting more micronutrition, you're going to want more healthier things. That's what we start, we see with kids. So these are, it's much more than 35 now, um, but I think it's 42 now. We have 42 peer reviewed, published, that's a big deal, published uh, clinical studies. And these are the universities, some of them, and um, we just two came out in the summer, I think it was last summer for gut health and what it does in, it helps to feed the microbiome. Um, the studies showed that basically the microbiome, your gut, um, we need to have lots of good bacteria in that gut. For a lot of people, it's more of the bad bacteria just because the food we're eating is feeding the bad guys. 80% of the, the immune system is, resides in the gut, right? So this showed that when you have a lot of, if you have good bacteria in your gut, which is what the shred does, putting juice plus in on a daily basis actually has proven that it feeds the good bacteria so they grow more, right? Because it's not always about the probiotics, it's about feeding the good guys that are there. So this is what it looks like, okay? It's a journey, it's all it is, it's a journey. You start with where you're at and what you feel comfortable with, okay? So we look at using the juice plus products. This is for a lot of us on the call, this is what we use. Um, one of the things I want to mention, I think is really important. I talk about this probably every single day with people is this product for those of you that don't know that are here listening, that don't know this product is not a vitamin mineral supplement whole food or sorry, health Canada has this product under whole foods, a whole food product, like any other whole food product that you know of like that on the, you know, that in the store. It's under a whole food product. It's not under the supplement category. It is very different from supplements that we all know, okay? So remember that when you are eating, so it's whole food, number one, that is a big deal. The thing is, is that when we're eating vitamins and minerals, they're lab made, they're man made. Man cannot mimic what nature has created. Okay, so when you are taking synthetic vitamins and minerals, you look at your bottle and you see the, I, I don't have the screen, we have this uh, slide on another webinar, but you take your bottle of vitamins and you see on it vitamin A and how much and vitamin D and how much and all the vitamins. That shows you that it's synthetic. Your body doesn't recognize synthetic. That's why your, your urine is yellow, right? And yes, you might notice changes for sure, 
But over the long period, research has actually shown that those can actually, those supplements can actually damage your gut. It can actually, you know, synthetic vitamins and minerals compete with one another. So if you have too much um, zinc, let's talk about zinc right now because of the season. If you are taking too much zinc, your copper levels can be completely messed up. Now, what levels of zinc are you at? I have no idea, right? You don't know. So then it's like, this is why when we take a whole food supplement, those nutrients that you saw on that screen, all those foods, they're working synergistically together. They're working together and balancing each other out. So your body, if it says, well, I need more zinc, it's zinc comes from food, right? Then it's going to take the zinc it needs. If it needs more vitamin C, like the berries right there, not just the berries, the red and the greens have vitamin C, like peppers have vitamin C, right? But we'll just say berries because we are very deficient in berries. Those berries basically are um, so high in vitamin C. Elderberry, which is so good for your immune system, is in there, right? So you're taking that, your body's going to take what it needs. Now, if you're under the weather, you take more. So I was under the weather at Christmas time on Boxing Day, and I loaded up on this. I, and like, even on Monday, we had a huge day on Monday and it was very, very long. And I doubled up. I was, I think I took four, four of each color and wow. Did I, I actually felt balanced. I actually felt balanced. Like you feel it. I feel it going through my veins. I ran out. Thankfully, Dana, my angel came to my rescue. I ran out and, um, cause my whole family takes it, ran out. And I noticed a difference. Like I was like, I was busting my butt <laughs> and Dana's like, I'll come over and bring some to you. And I'm like, oh, thank God. And I'm still waiting for my supply to come in. So that's the kind of stuff you feel. So micronutrition is the, is the, um, the bottles there that you see the colors. And then the macronutrition macro is carbohydrates, proteins, and carbs that comes from the chip. So you get a, you get a shred guide. Um, in the Facebook group that we have, there's going to be, we've got lots of leaders in there for the 10 days. It starts February 14th. What's going to happen is people, um, the leaders are going to be posting. Those of you that are joining us, I know there's many of you on the call that are joining us. Um, you've already told us that. So I, I'm, we're going to encourage you post, just post your picture of your shake, post a picture of something that you made. That group is there to inspire you, to encourage you, to know that you have support. It's, and it's, it's very motivating when you're like all every day seeing people post their stuff and seeing their meals and be like, oh my gosh, that looks so good. I'm going to make that, right? Um, I'm going to share actually uh, Dr. Mitra Ray, amazing woman. I'm going to share her video in there. Um, a daily detox with Shred uh, 10. Mitra Ray is awesome. So, you know, looking at that. Um, what else? And um, yeah, and then also we always say share with others, right? Because it's important for um, for others to um, to come along, right? Because we do this with um, other people, it's much more fun. I don't really like this slide, to be honest. I don't really like this slide. I like my other slide that I use. So let me just, I'm gonna share this with you. So um, this is distracting me. So I'm gonna share with you how you get involved. And um, hold on, let me go back here. I'm going to share with you how you get involved and I'm going to share with you um, what the investment is. Okay. So there are for the shred program specifically, we do use the shakes as you saw, and we do encourage the trio and the Omega. Now, my thing is, is that depending on where you're coming on up, for those of you that are brand new, okay, I always recommend the quad. Okay, and the reason I recommend the quad is because, well, if you're not taking an omega, you, you need to take an omega from somewhere. And I don't want people taking, I don't want to send people to the store to take a fish oil, right? So um, this omega a month, to give you an idea, or a day is like a dollar a day. It's like $38. If you go to the store, you'll, you'll get something that's not as good of a quality and you're, pay, you're paying about $50, $55. Okay, so I've compared, trust me. Um, now, of course, you can't compare in terms of the quality and all of that, but in terms of price, okay? Um, I'm glad that this product is not sold in the store because I wouldn't be able to educate. Education is key as a, as a professional. When my people that I get started, my clients, 
you know, customers, whoever it is, when they are educated as to why and why this is different, it's, it's a game changer. They get it, right? If this was on a store shelf, you would look at all the products on the shelf and you'd be like, well, this one's more expensive than this one. So I'll just go with the one that's less expensive. However, we don't, don't know about the vine ripen. We don't know all this stuff, the, the, the farms and all of, and all of the reasons of what goes in the NSF testing and the research and all of this education is key. So that's the Omega. So now when we talk about the trio, the very minimal that I, I would start somebody on is a trio because I like to find out where people are at. Okay. So the trio is basically when you take the purples, the berries, the berries actually help. We know this through research, help the red and the greens actually absorb better. So I have seen people on the trio because most of my people are on at least the trio versus I know other people who have put their, um, their customers on just the red and the green, other friends of mine in the community. And they've told me, they're like, how come your people get all these results? And I mean, red and green is better than nothing, right? However, we want the greatest results, right? And so the trio is $3 a day, $3 a day. Like when we go to Starbucks or Tim Hortons, those are the two places people go a lot often, they're spending much more than $3. So we have to shift our perspective. So the trio with the Omega, that's $4 a day right? It's $4 a day. Where are we spending more than that? Or where are we spending? I think of it as, okay, this is health insurance. You know, we don't know what's going to happen down the road, but what I can promise you is it's much easier to help you when you're standing than to have to pick you up off the floor. And I share this, many of you have heard me say this before, and I share this all the time because it's just, it needs to be shared. And um, this is many years ago, like I've worked with women for many years in my practice and um, women would come in. I remember three women specifically, and I remember them coming in. Oh, obviously, they don't know each other. And um, I remember specifically different times and not even in the same kind of like six month period or whatever. It doesn't it doesn't even matter. And I remember them saying, you know, they they didn't they told me they said, you know what? I don't think I can. I don't think I can pay for that. They don't never say invest. That's um, cause it's investment. They don't say that I, they say, cause it's a mindset, right? They say, I, I can't, I can't afford that. And I said, no problem. Like, you know, it, no problem. And so no judgment, whatever. So they go and they had stuff going on. Like they, they needed to do something. They had symptoms. They weren't feeling good. They didn't have the energy. I know when people tell me these things, that is your body screaming. I need your help. You've got to do something, but we're not taught that to listen to symptoms. We're taught when we have a a whole list of symptoms, we go to the doctor and they give us something for that. But the problem is it's not getting to the root cause of the problem, right? We're not looking at releasing toxins. Toxins cause illness. We know that, right? We're not looking at what food we're putting in. They're not looking, that's not their training. So um, anyways, the same story for each of these women and with different problems. And it was inflammatory problems. It was mitochondrial problems. It was hormonal problems. Like I could help them. Com I was 150% confident. And it's so hard because it's like, I just, you just sometimes want it more than them. And those th the same three women, this was years ago at different times again. Um, one of them actually, I happened to see in a store and she actually had a, like a full-blown autoimmune condition. <sighs> and then and that two of the other ones had cancer afterwards. And I can't remember how, what the length of time afterwards, I don't remember. Remember with cancer as well, it's an, an illness like that. You're not, you don't have cancer. You're not sick because you have cancer. You have cancer because you're sick. You don't have an, auto, you're not sick with an autoimmune. You have autoimmune because you're sick. It starts with what's going on within your body. Okay. What time is it? Cause I'm starting to, okay. 741. I'm almost done. I get on my, I get on my train here my, <clears throat> my passion comes out. <clears throat> so, um, just know that I don't believe that anyone here is here by accident. Um, I've seen amazing results with just putting micronutrition in your body. 
And, you know, all I, all I encourage you to think about is I don't know what's going on in your body right now. For some of you, you feel great and that's awesome. We don't know what's going on in our body, right? We need to look at how we can alkalize. We need to look at reducing inflammation. We need to look at managing stress. And that's what we do in our community. And we do that with the help of this, this, these, this product juice plus, because this is what you're eating. This is what we should be eating, right? I hate the word should, but you know what I mean? We're not getting, and this product fills the gap because if you're not taking this, you'll have to take something. And so I just want to really build this case as to why this is the best investment for our health. I've been here for 13 years. All right. And we have other nutritionists and health um, practitioners here on the, the zoom tonight that would say the exact same thing. So I always, I, well, not always, but for the most part, when I'm at corporations or doing podcasts or any of these things, I always end by saying this. Okay. So don't, I don't want you to look at me. I want you to hear me. Okay. So I want you to hear me. So close your eyes and I just want you to take a breath and then exhale slowly, let your shoulders drop and just keep your eyes closed and just focus on that breathing. And I just want you to listen to me when you have your health, you have a thousand dreams. When you don't, you only have one. So my question for you is, if not now, when? So I would like to open it up. Dana, I'm assuming here, I'm gonna leave the recording on. We have three in the chat. And did I lose Dana? I might've lost Dana. Sometimes her internet gets wonky. Oh no, she's, I think she's in here. Okay, I'm just gonna go through this ladies. Oh yeah, okay. So is it only the shakes that balance insulin or do the bars help as well? The bars Susan do as well. Yeah, um, thank you actually for asking that question. So one of the things that I wanna mention is that, um, hold on, let me just stop share here. Okay, one of the things that I wanna mention is that I actually just posted this testimonial um, on my Instagram stories today. And um, so thank you, Susan, for asking that question because yes, the shakes do. However, remember what Hippocrates said, let food be thy medicine, medicine be thy food. One of the things that we see happen quite often, um, you know, we can't use disease names, blood sugar issues, there's a, there's a, and you didn't see the slide. We show a slide in our other webinar of the common diseases that are the top diseases. And there is one, and I don't, I'm not gonna use the names, but there is one that is a blood sugar issue. Um, blood sugar issues are based on everything, really all illnesses, but it's a major one that we all know of. And I can't tell you how many people tell me after using the capsules, they, their, their blood sugar levels, when they're actually testing themselves after meals and all the stuff they have to do, their blood sugar, sugar levels actually come down dramatically. That's not because this is healing them. Nothing heals you. If anyone ever tells you that this is gonna heal you, this drug's gonna heal you, this supplement's gonna heal you, it's not gonna heal you, right? Nothing heals you, your body heals itself. We have to get into a lifestyle of cleansing and detoxifying, which is what Shred does in the ways that we did, right? It's a lifestyle. And that's when your body is going to start to balance out. It's all about your body's just looking to be in balance. Okay. So yes, the shakes do. And yes, the bars, because the bar is just the shake in a bar form. But when you're taking the capsules, um, you start to see changes. And as Dana already said at the very beginning, what happened with her in that short period of time doesn't mean that's going to be your story because everyone's body is different. Um, but if you're on the product and you're not noticing changes in your energy right away, it's just because your body's like energy's not like energy is a sign that your cells are thriving. Okay. So if you are in the day and you don't have energy, then that's your body saying, I'm not thriving, right? I'm lacking something. Like when I eat my tower garden salad, I feel good afterwards. Right. So, um, yeah, so it's just about fueling our body and um, really focus on lifestyle. Did I miss anything, Dana or Victoria? You're muted. Or you're just not saying anything? You're muted. Oh, Dana's trying to talk. See, you're doing what I do. 
There's a great question there. Oh, hold on. I can answer it or you can go ahead and answer it. Oh, yes. Not a fan of swelling pills at all. <laughs> can I open up? And, yeah, absolutely. Actually, I just um, set up somebody uh, on Sunday and she has a baby and she actually, now the children's health study is from four until 21, as long as the child is in school. Um, now this, so the reason why they say four is generally because of choking hazards because they're using the gummies. Um, I have people that are younger, depending on even what's going on in the baby, it's just food, right? Um, and so with her um, young one, I have her opening up the capsules and putting it in his bottle. So we do like, so we take, this is the one I haven't eaten yet. So this is my red. I would have her open this up. You have to be careful because it's jam packed. See that there, it's jam packed. And then I would put half of it in the food in the morning or in whatever, and then half later on. Or actually, no, I told her three times a day, right? It's a little bit meticulous, but whatever, it's food, right? Our kids aren't getting the nutrients either. Um, and so I think Victoria, you told me, these are two things I had from people. So Victoria said that it broke open or something. Remember when you first got them, it broke open and you take, you were like, oh, I'll just eat it. And you were like, oh my gosh, this tastes like, it was like produce, right? Yeah, it dropped, it dropped on the floor. And I was like, there's no way I'm throwing this in the garbage. This is like liquid gold. So no, I thought, well, I wonder what it tastes like. Cause I like to try stuff. And yeah, I opened it up and yeah, it was delicious. So I thought I better try all of them. And yeah, sure enough, they're all good. <laughs> yeah. And I had another lady actually, I set up last spring and she said, she said, so she took the bottle. This is, she hadn't even tasted it. She took the bottle, opened the bottle up to take a couple capsules. And she said, I have this, I share this as a testimony because it's just, it's so amazing. She's like, I could not believe the smell when I opened the capsule. It was fresh. It was like, it was from the farm. She said, and she hadn't even tried them. She's like, I'll be on this stuff for life. That's what she texted me. <laughs> and I was like, that's exactly what we're talking about. Right. So sorry, Chris, I didn't answer all of it. Um, do you have gummies that do what? Yeah. So the gummies are, I will give gummies to kids. If kids can take capsules, I will suggest that the, I always suggest the capsules, even if you have to open them up because the capsules are more concentrated and they're, I guess they're more potent. I notice when I have gummies, cause I actually, so I take the two of each color, typically of four bottles a day. And um, I also have a lot of gummies here as well. Cause my younger one likes the gummies. And I was just sitting here even after my, so on Monday I had the four capsules all throughout the day. And then I had, um, and then I, at the nighttime, because it was a late night for us um, here in Juice Plus and I had get bags of gummies and I'm just sitting there as I'm like messaging from one person to the other. And I'm like <laughs> eating almost the enti entire bag. And then my dog was sitting there because when he hears the gummy bag, he comes running over and I'm sharing with waffles. And we were having a gummy party on the couch. But I will tell you that I noticed for me personally, I notice more when I put it in, the capsules in. I just, I can, I, I know it sounds funny, but I'm very in tune with my body. It's like I can feel the nutrients, the micronutrition like filling my veins up. That's what it feels like. And when I, I ran like running out for a, a one time I ran out for a week because my ship was coming and I'm like, oh, I'll be fine. Not a good idea. It was not a good idea. And that came in and I just put them back. And it was like, I said to my husband, oh my gosh, like I feel like, you know, when an incredible Hulk turns into that, the green monster, that's what I felt like. Except I wasn't a green monster. I was a glowing monster. So yeah. So, um, so basically let me just kind of overview here. So the shred starts, um, February 14th on the Monday, the idea is all about the self-love. So this is really about you committing to yourself so you can fill your cup up and give to others, right? This is a lifestyle. This is not, we do a 10 day program and then you're good and that's it. And you're on your way. It's a start to something better. So we start with 10 days, but our hope is that you continue with the habit, even if you're not doing the 10 guidelines, it doesn't matter. You just do what feels good for you. The person that invited you here, whoever your coach is, you go to them and you say, you know what, this is what I'm feeling comfortable with. And then we say, great, start with that. And we encourage you. And then you're going to feel good about yourself and your belief in yourself is going to be better, especially for those of you that have a history of dieting, 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 nothing works, you know, that mindset, 
you give yourself the habits and you commit to those, even if it's one, two, juice plus is going to be the first one. You got to take that. And then whatever other one or two other, and then you start seeing, wow, like I feel different. Wow. Like good for, you know, good job. You know, this is I'm making me feel good. And you're believing yourself. And then you can do something else later on, right? It's about a ha habit. My hair is thinning and my scalp is itchy. Should I take more mega? Yeah. Angel, I don't know how many you're taking, but you can take four. Um, I typically muscle test myself. Um, my husband takes four a day and yeah, you can, it doesn't hurt if you're dry. The other thing too, is you got to make sure you're drinking water right? It's not just about taking supplements and eating good food. Okay, good. You want to make sure you have that because many times also right now it's really, really dry. Like because of the cold and the heat is on, like my poor plants are like <laughs> shriveling up and I'm like, oh my gosh, it is dry in here. My throat gets dry and we need more water. So we need more water in the winter. And then the summertime comes, we need more water because it's hot. I started putting my pills into the smoothie in the blender. Awesome. That you can absolutely do that for sure. So um, what else? So like I said, we put you into the Facebook group. Um, if you're not on Facebook, I tell people if you, it's just the reason why we use it is because it is a group. It's a way that I like to do this kind of thing. I like to do lives and education. It's just easier for me than a post. We have other leaders in here that are gonna be posting, doing videos, um, just inspiration. And when we're all doing this together, it just empowers you. And, it, and you, cause doing it by yourself is boring. Like it really, I'm not going to really do it by myself, to be honest. So I do this for me too. Um, I'm already on the quad. So how would you transfer the shred 10? Um, nothing. You just add the shakes. So Julie, I, I don't think I've met you yet. So whoever invited you here, um, you go back to, is it Victoria? I don't know. Whoever, whoever you would basically. It was Dana. Oh, Dana. Awesome. Okay. I don't think I met you, Julie. Um, so nice to meet you. So yeah, Dana can set you up with the shakes and, um, yeah. And you'll, you can even start when you get them, you can start the shakes. You don't have to wait until we start the shred. Um, and all, everything will be linked in the group. Okay. So if you don't have a Facebook account, what I recommend is I always tell people, if you can just do an account just for that group and also just for 500 families, because the other thing I wanted to mention is within our community when we you are a juice plus customer of ours um even if you're just starting with the tower even if it's like you know what i i'm gonna just start with the omega that's okay now for the shred program the idea for the shred is you know it's the shakes and the, all of that's going to fuel your body to help your body shed the toxins to feel better to fuel your metabolism and your hormones this is why right but you get um, also you get to be part of our 500 family group where every Tuesday night we have educational sessions led by different, uh, especially Alyssa, which you definitely want to be at her sessions. You will learn tons. I sometimes do them. There's other leaders that do them as well and, and coaches. So that is there for you for free. I'm telling you in that community, your life will change if you're at those listening to the recordings or being there. Uh, we can't get Prego uh, tried IVF low ovarian reserve and I have, okay. Um, can just plus help with my autoimmune. I'm not expecting to get, okay. So absolutely. Um, basically autoimmune is where your immune system is kind of just like kind of out of whack, we'll just say. And so really it starts with the foundations, right? This is a foundation. So one of the things as a nutritionist I teach is I'm, I don't teach, you know, going into depth with hormones and testing. Other people do that. What I believe is essential, regardless of all the rest of it, is we've got to have the foundation down. It's all about your habits. It's all about what you're doing every day. It's all about your lifestyle, all of that. So yes, if you have this going on, I would definitely say this is your more fruits and vegetables. Krista is going to help you tremendously. This micronutrition is going to fuel your body so it can start to heal right? And then what happens is, is as you're in the community and we start to see changes because you got to give that four month period, right? What happens in your body in four months is pretty amazing. And I'm sure, um, Krista, whoever, and I don't know who invited you here, but, um, we have a, a, an image that shows you what happens in four months and then another four months. You have to remember if you're dealing with something like that, with a health condition, it's been a long time that your body's been working on that 
if for lack of way of saying that, and then it's diagnosed. If you get to a diagnosis, it means that it's been, your body's been, if I want to say fighting for a long time to get into balance. Okay. So you may need additional, like, you know, Victoria and I will use herbs, this sort of thing. You may, you may not, I, I mean, everyone's body's different, but the first thing is you've got to start with the foundation. Okay. Really important. The bottle says to take two per day. If you take more than two, would you not run out? You would for sure, Susan, you would run out. Um, however, you want to look at it this way. If you get sick, like if you get a cold or flu, like how I got whatever in December, I was like, I don't care because I, I don't, I don't get sick. Maybe once every three, four years, I was telling Dana Victoria, I get hit hard. And this I think was the third year <laughs> or the fourth year. And um, I'm like, when you're hit, have any of you been sick here? And you know what it feels like? You don't care, right? So if it, yes, you'll run out, but what we can do is call customer service. We need you to get better. That's the most important thing. We just have them move your, your order date back. That's all, it's really simple, but you gotta get well, right? And when you're sick, it means your body needs more. When your body has a condition, it means you need more micronutrition. If you are dealing like uh, Krista, what you're dealing with, um, your body is out of balance. It, it, it wants to be in balance. And so you need more. Okay. So you need more because remember what I said at the beginning is if you're eating really, really well, and then you take juice plus the juice plus the whole food concentrate is going to go to the area in your body that needs to have, um, repair and healing. Okay. So that's what it's going to be doing. Ah, any other questions? Those are good questions, actually. A lot of great questions. I just want to add that the children, I have children because that's my specialty, that take the omegas, they pop them in their mouth, chew them up and swallow them because our capsules are made of tapioca and seaweed. Mm -hmm. So it's really good knowing what's, you know, the capsules made of tapioca and seaweed. Yeah. All, everything's plant. Anything that's in the product, NSF certification says that what is said, what's um, on the bottle has to be on the product and what's in the product has to be on the bottle. There's nothing left, Janine. Um, so yeah, so um, I'm just thinking, did I miss anything? I don't think so, um, but we want you to join us. I will add that. Okay, we want you to join us and um, it's great fun. We're doing this again next Tuesday, did I say? Tuesday, because our Tower Garden webinar is next Wednesday. Come back next Tuesday. It's the same webinar, but you never know what else I'm going to say that's different. And invite people. Definitely invite people. If you listen tonight and you're like, oh, this person needs to come and oh, this person needs to hear this. And oh, bring them on, right? Just bring them on. Learning is good. If you're not learning, you're dying, right? But I do encourage you to, I ask myself this question too. If now, not now, like when I bought the Tower Garden, Last year, when I bought the Tower Garden, I wanted this thing. I've been with Juice Plus for 13 years. I wanted it for so long. And I always had the reasons why it wasn't the right time, right? And because we do that as humans. And so given it, you know, what's going on in the world, and I was like, you know what? Uh, like I, I knew back probably a year ago, even longer, I heard about food shortages coming because of just what's going on in the world and the supply chain breakdown, chain, whatever it's called, breakdowns. And I was like, you know what? I said to my husband, you know what? I'm just going to get it. And I, and I just got it. And did I have the money all set aside? I mean, it is pretty affordable. It's 12 interest-free payments. You'll learn about that next week. And I was like, you know what? There's no time like the present. Like I was never, it was always a reason why I wasn't doing it. And I'm like, I need to be prepared for whatever, right? I need to be prepared. And, and I've always been like that. So I did it. And it wasn't actually so bad. It was like, wow, this is pain. It grows and it grows and it grows. It was a, it was such a good investment. So just remember anything related to your health is an investment. We pay health insurance just in case, or like life insurance or whatever, I guess it's health insurance, or we pay insurance right on our house on whatever, just in case something happens, right? We hope that nothing happens but we have to have that there. It's the same sort of thing. It's our health insurance, right? So, but I will, I will tell you that it's less likely something will help it happen when you're using it. All of our bodies are different, but you have a much better chance being in this community and being growing older, healthier than where you are today than if you weren't with us. 
I can speak very confidently. Um, you know, I, I mean, it's been a long time in being in this industry, but just from what what we've accomplished, you know, Dana, Victoria, and I, just even since Victoria, you started, and then Dana, when you started, and then just in a very short period of time, and then all the time that I've been sharing this before they came in, is amazing. Like we have healthy, happy people, and it's so exciting, and I love it. So that's it for me. I'm going to stop talking because I'll have you here for another hour because I love this. So thanks, Angel, for coming. So ladies, uh, that's it for me. If there's no other questions, have a great night. And we will be here again next Tuesday. And go back to the person that invited you and um, join us. You won't regret it. I promise you, you will not regret it. And you have people to, to keep you accountable and to cheer you on. And it's a lot of fun. Okay. Bye. Nothing else, Dana, Victoria? Everything's good? Okay. Amazing. All right. Oh, good I night, everybody. Got to stop this recording. Okay. <laughs>